Hi everyone, welcome to Beyond Paths. Today we're going to talk about timeless kitchen accessories that everyone should have. And by that I mean a very minimalist way of uh, decorating your kitchen without over cluttering it, without buying all the gadgets, all the crazy stencils that you see everywhere. Because honestly they just take up space and just because they're in the way and you barely use them once or twice a year maybe. But before getting into the video, don't forget to like and subscribe, it really helps me grow and it allows me to create more content for you. So let's get to the video. I created a small list of things that I use regularly if you're starting a new kitchen or if you're just planning on decluttering everything and getting rid of things you don't use or that they just take out space and I'm gonna tell you all the things that I use these objects for on a daily basis I'm gonna start with the first one which is a very nice wooden cutting board and the one I have is pretty big, I got it from Ikea it's been useful so many times I use it for obviously cutting things on it, I use it for presentation boards, I use it as a cheese board, or I use it just when I'm too lazy to grab a plate from the <laughs> cupboard. And it's usually like a nice way of putting breakfast together and having it all in one place. I recommend a nice wooden board or it can be even a piece of uh, stone, it can be marble as well, so yeah. <laughs> The next item on the list is a nice salt and pepper shakers because um, that's definitely something that you can decorate your kitchen with and it makes sense to be there and it's not gonna clutter your space so you can actually use it for salt and pepper or any other kind of spice you want to put in there you can get a grinder and it's a nice addition to the look of the kitchen if you're a fan of cooking, you are gonna need spices, obviously, and if you're not the kind of person that uses spices, then I recommend you should because it brings so much flavor to your food. If you have space, obviously, for this and you want to be more organized, I think you should get some nice spice rack or just get some nice containers that you can fill out with spices. I have a tiny row of spices in the kitchen and it's so much easier to use, especially when you rush out cooking. And I think it's a nice way of decorating your kitchen and keeping it decluttered because in this way you probably free out some space that you have with all the packages and packs of spices that we get from the store. They're not really very appealing and they get damaged so in time I think it's it's nice to, to have your own spice rack and it definitely incentivizes you to cook more because, you know, you're gonna want to use all of those spices. If you're in an area that has bad water quality or if you need to filter your water, I recommend investing into a nice water pitcher uh, that also doubles down as a filter and dispenser. We have one as well, unfortunately all that we found so far is made out of plastic and we're trying to change that because plastic is still not good to continue water in. So if you find something that's made of glass, I think it's a nice addition to your kitchen. If you regularly drink flavored water, let's say you want to put some cucumber in there or lemons, I think you can find some really nice options out there. Who else wants to eat more fruit? Because I do. I feel the need to eat fruit and because I don't have it in front of me at all times, I just forget about it. Usually, if I bring out groceries and I put them in the fridge, they're just gonna end up at the bottom of the fridge and I'm just gonna forget about them. So if you want to also do that and engage in a more healthy diet, I recommend getting a fruit basket or a fruit bowl that you put on your table or on your kitchen counter and that you fill out with fruits because this way, if the fruits are not in the fridge, you're gonna see them and you're gonna wanna eat them because they look so appealing. And it, it brings out a nice pop of color in your kitchen. You can find many types of fruit bowls and many types of designs. You can get so creative with it, you can go crazy, you can find models that are maybe make no sense, like this one. <laughs> but I think it's a fun way to, you know, store fruit and try and eat healthier. Next up, I think a ceramic tea set or 
coffee teas, uh, depending on which one you like most. I think almost everyone drinks something warm in the morning. Maybe you're not that kind of person, maybe you like your coffee in the afternoon, but again, it doesn't really matter. As long as you have it somewhere that you don't have to dig for in the kitchen, it's a much nicer way of starting your morning. I think everyone should have these things in their kitchen. I think everyone has a utensil holder for quick grab next to their stove or next to their oven that obviously is much use easier to use if it's right there rather than going back to the utensil drawer and looking for it while your things are burning on the stove. <laughs> so I think getting something that complements your kitchen aesthetics is also a timeless accessory that you can have. And again, it's useful, it holds out any utensils that you need right away. So these are some of the things that I think are timeless, they can be minimalist, and they can help you reorganize your kitchen in a much better way. It can help declutter your space, make it feel more clean and aesthetic looking, so let me know what you think in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe, it helps out immensely.